हे अस्सलाम वालेकुम टुडेस वीडियो इज अबाउट डर्माटोफाइट इंफेक्शंस नाउ द क्वेश्चन इज व्हाट आर डर्माटोफाइट इंफेक्शंस मोस्ट बेसिक फंगल स्किन इंफेक्शंस आर कॉज्ड बाय डर्माटोफाइट्स इट्स अ टाइप ऑफ फंजाई दैट कॉज स्किन नेल एंड हेयर इंफेक्शंस डर्माटोफाइट्स आर अ ग्रुप ऑफ थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ फंगस दैट कॉमनली कॉजेस स्किन डिजीजेस इन ह्यूमंस and animals these anamorphic genera are microsporum epidermophyton trichophyton there are about 40 species in these three genera ringworm infection ringworm is actually an infection caused by a fungus it is called ringworm because it can cause a ring shaped red itchy rash on the skin ringworm is also called tinea there are four different types of ringworm infections number 1 tinea capitis it affects the top of the head or scalp and is usually found in children number 2 tinea pedis it affects the feet and is also called athlete's foot and it is very common number 3 tinea cruris it affects the groin and is also called jock itch number 4 tinea carporis it is the catch all term for tinea infections on other body surfaces now we will talk about tinea pedis it is also known as athlete's foot it's often caused by a combination of fungi and bacteria it causes scaling and sogginess of the skin between the toes skin becomes pale and can be itchy tinea pedis is caused by variety of dermatophyte fungi it can spread through direct contact with infection by skin particles left on towels shoes floors of shower stalls and around swimming pools and even pedicure shops and it can also be caused when you walk barefoot in the shower at the gym or around the pool and it is very common in diabetic patients treatment of tinea pedis this disease is usually treated by using antifungal products and by maintaining some basic hygiene for this you need to wash and dry your feet two to three times a day change your socks or stockings daily sprinkle antifungal powder on your feet proper aeration of feet is also very necessary the people who are infected with this disease should wear those shoes which are made up of natural or porous material or of a leather fabric next one is tinea cruris it is also known as ringworm of groin this is called jock itch because it occurs in sports people it causes an itchy red rash in the groin and surrounding area and is commonly seen in men who have been sweating a lot Now we will talk about the causes of this disease. This fungus mainly grows in warm and moist part of the body. Overweight and profusely sweating people can also get infected. And the symptoms of this disease include jock itch rashes that affect the skin of the genitals and inner thighs, formation of itchy and reddened skin that can get quite sore and painful. Tinea cruris is treated by maintaining self-care at home. Home remedies like vinegar socks, baking soda, and tea tree oil are also effective. And in severe cases, antifungal creams, lotions, and sprays are also used. Now we will talk about Tinea carporis. It is also known as ringworm of the body. This usually affects the body, abdomen. and limbs causing red patches these patches are usually scaly at the edge with clear skin at the center and the patches spread out from the center it can be caught from domestic animals tinea carporis is caused by person to person transfer usually via direct skin contact with an infected in- individual it can also spread through animal to human transmission and through ringworms ringworms that are commonly occur on pets like dogs cats horses pigs and cows etc and this disease is also common in the people who have weak immune system 
to treat this disease wash hands after handling animals soil and plants wear loose fitting clothing practice good hygiene when participating in sports that involves physical contact with other people most cases are treated by application of antifungal creams to the skin but in extensive cases systematic treatment with oral medication may be required next infection is tinea capitis which is also known as ringworm of the scalp this tends to affect young children and can cause hair loss with inflammation in the affected area its symptoms include thickened scaly red rings severe itching of the scalp dandruff and bald patches tinea capitis is treated by taking oral therapy antifungal medicine like ketoconazole intraconazole terbinafen and fluconazole are also used selenium sulfide shampoo may reduce the risk of spreading the infection now we will talk about some nail infections onychomycosis is the name for any fungal nail infection tinea angoyum is a common infection the nails become malformed thickened and crumbly in this condition the pupil with lower immunity system due to diabetes hiv and poor circulation are the common victims of this disease sweaty shoes and moist socks can also be a contributing factor its symptoms include brittleness thickening or formation of ridges on the nail loss of luster and shine the nail becomes discolored distortion of nail shape crumbling of the nail and changes occur to one or more nails the infections are commonly treated by using creams ointments and prescribed antifungal medicines and in some cases oral medication is also prescribed that's all from today's video if you like the information press the like button subscribe to my channel and do share it with others